Good morning, guys. Welcome to today. Today is scorching. Did you hear Gabby? You should just be able to walk in and feed the horses. It's true, but I want to bring you guys with me. Don't you want to bring them with us? Don't you want to share your life, Gabby? Gabby's like, it takes too long to share your life. Here, give me the girls. I got them down pat now. Today, we are headed off on a girl adventure. Back it up, little pony. Look at all the boy poop in here. It's rude when boys come to your house and just poop, huh? There you go. There you go. Oh, look at how cute. I love pictures of everything, all, all of our animals all lined up in a row. Yeah, like Willow's belly looks chubby. I'm gonna buy dewormer. They love cool dewormer. We have a big trip to the tax so store happening this weekend. Now. Probably go next week. I want to divide it up so that we're not shopping all the time in a uh, heat wave. Still waiting for Sophie. But honestly, heat wave galore. So hot out there. Hello, Sophie. Taste test for horses. Okay, taste test for horses is gonna have to wait. Oh, no, it's gonna snack and horses can eat it. In our family, we don't eat that stuff before breakfast. Oh, I already ate all mine. Oh my gosh. How much you got part of this? How come you got party snacks? Because I grabbed them. Yeah, she goes wherever dad goes shopping, she goes. Oh, and fish chips. All right, we're in a hurry today. Why are you bringing that in before the horses go out? There's no way the horses are going to fit. Eating? Yeah. So this is compressed hay. I'm going to give all this to Chino. I'm going to weigh it too. Okay, so this is that little bit of hay. It's 25 pounds of hay. That might be too much hay for him. 25 pounds of hay. But I like him to have as much hay as he can eat. That's double. He usually gets about 12 pounds of hay twice a day. So that is double what he needs. I missed it. Gracie was waiting for the grass. She was standing there staring at the grass. She's like, let me go for grass. I've actually been checking in their hooves to make sure they're good too. And they are. The hard thing about this compressed hay is that it's just all little pieces. So you can't like lift up a bit, lift up any. Is already scorching. Poor boys. Yeah, you do that when I gotta go get the water. So now I have to do the hardest part, which is the water. The water sucks. Our hose doesn't reach all the way down to that last field. That's all right, though. I got it. I mean, Only five it. loads of heavy water. Okay, mm. so Finn hates cheese, but Will and Gracie love cheese. <laughs> I know somebody else who loves cheesies. Mm. Yeah. Is All right. No. Are we ready to roll? You guys ready to go or do you have to do anything else? Go. But I'm I need ready to go. I need to grab. I think you need to put shorts on. It's scorching out. I'm sweating. I'm sweating too. Buckets. All right. What are you doing with the puppy? Oh, I'm bringing her. And she has to eat. Yeah. Okay, go feed her. I don't know if I told you guys this, but our lesson got canceled yesterday. All the lessons, even at the barn, got canceled yesterday because of the heat. And so, yeah, we can't ride. We can't ride, but man, can we swim. And that's where I don't want the horses to be. See, that's what makes me nervous. Oh my gosh. Gabby just nailed life. That's 31 new requests. 31 new requests on Snapchat, and you had what? Oh wait, <laughs> I have 15 notifications. Oh, she's 15. It won't say because I visited already. Oh, she already has 15 new no notifications, but how many you had 60 something? Thank you to everybody. No, oh, 11 more. But last time when I was down at the barn, I checked, and it said 80. Oh, wow. I was like, I wonder was how like many 99. I have. 99. You said 99? Sister. Like so, all right. New and social media news. One, you guys are always telling me to tell Sophie she's such an inspiration. And I tell her, but it doesn't mean anything. Today she got a snap from a young girl, right? Mm -hmm. And it, what did it say? Um, that I inspired her to keep riding. Yeah, and it meant so much. So you guys got to tell Sophie all on your own in private because... She doesn't mean more coming from you guys. And then Gabby. It's this person. It's this beautiful girl. Hopefully she wants to be on our on our vlog. If you don't, I'm sorry. I'll, I'll, I'll text her. 
All right. Um, and Gabby found some hate on her Instagram. Not really hate, just people spewing. Oh, no, it was a girl being an idiot. Somebody being what not nice. And Gabby went off, and when she read it to me, all my when she read it to me, when she read it to me, I was like, wow, like, I'm raising some really good girls. Because, I mean, sometimes when you read things, you can get really frustrated and get, like, mad and mean. And she was just so respectful. Yeah, but she was so respectful and so proper. Like, she didn't say anything really bad at Hope it doesn't turn into a war though, because that would be bad. All right, we are headed out. I had to put my hair up, like in this kind of heat. Oh man, it's bad. All right, so I don't think Molly can come with us. Because uh, there's raccoons and foxes and all that kind of stuff where we are, and she hasn't had her second set of shots yet. Next week. Sophie asked the girl if she didn't mind being in the vlog, and she said sure, so that's why she's in the vlog. So don't feel nervous to respond to us and that we're just going to throw anybody into the vlog because we won't. Uh, it's not coloring time, but let's go, let's go. We're just waiting for Gabby and then we are headed out. We're headed on a long drive. She kind of makes me nervous. I know I'm a nervous person, but you know what? I am a nervous person, but I'm still getting out there and doing all the things I want. Like, I need to be able to do all the things that I want. Usually I wait for Sam for something like this, but today I'm braving it because I need to get out. I need to get away from this house. I can only swim so many hours. Yesterday I was so hot, I drank a whole thing of water in one gulp. First time I've ever done that. All right, take 257 of Gabby in her winter clothes going out in the hot, humid sun. 80,000. Do you not like your shorts or you just don't want to wear shorts? She likes her comfort. Okay, so we are getting breakfast. What does breakfast look like for the day by day family? It's 10 o'clock. We are having breakfast on the go, and it looks like, what are you getting, Gabby? Mocha ice cap. Mocha ice cap. So grilled we were cheese. grilled cheese, and I'm getting a farmer's wrap, which is super yummy. Gabby's doing fan stuff. Like, I love that the girls are getting more into fans. Like, I love that they... No, it's just because I'm beating Kaylee at friends on Snapchat. Oh, she wants to beat Kaylee at friends on Snapchat. I can't <laughs> so follow Gabby on Snapchat so she can beat Kaylee. Yeah, see, I'm no, bad I example. Don't want too much, though. She doesn't want too or much, else. though. I can't chat with everybody, and Aww. it's a lot right now. Aww, I feel like that sometimes, too. You know, that finger flick. When that finger is flicking for a long time, that means she's got a lot. So yeah, it might take some time. I can keep up. Keep, keep up. trying. Mocha ice cap. Wow, our beautiful trailer site looks like nothing now. Look, there's some potting mix. Should bring that home. My flowers. Yeah, so basically. So I'm gonna throw whatever I want to take home? Yeah, whatever you want to take home. So basically, we're at the trailer. You guys know Sam spent all day here the other day trying to get the trailer gone and then he ended up driving the trailer someplace far away for the people that took the trailer and um so today the girls and i came to try and pack up the rest of the stuff that we have to take home so that we can make less trouble and less work for him because it's father's day weekend we gotta be nice so we have this shed Whew. And I definitely want to, like, there's lots of garbage. We have to take all the garbage with us. There's lots of stuff I want to keep, or a few things I want to keep. They've got up some bikes here. And so we're going to just clean it out and see what we can do. Apparently, this is what cleaning the trailer area, cleaning the shed looks like. Not helping. Gabby's trying a TikTok trend. What's... We need water. You need water? Need That's water. the problem. We have no water, so we need to get done so we can get home so we can get water. Oh, you're making a heart? I found a shell for a turtle. Yeah, a, shirt, a turtle shell. That would have been painful coming out of your shell. And it has its spine. Yeah. But then mom has to be a shark. Yeah, turtle shell or shark? We have rope not even open. I know, it was in the shed. I also have a little thing here that I'm going to put succulents in, which I love. Um, and maybe paint it. I have a turtle shell on mom's purse. Yeah, on my purse, on my expensive michael kors yeah. first you have a turtle shell mm, fabulous uh so this is it this is our whole truck load i also oh you brought that i also have three garbage bags i need to get rid of still a lot of junk that's okay you we can't do every paint. room was not built in a day we have spray paint Don't you got the spray paint it's in there 
I also have a screwdriver because you never know when you're gonna need a screwdriver. Oh, oh, um, here's the turtle shell. Oh, <laughs> she lifted up the turtle shell. She's got the turtle shell and the net. Gabby almost died. But yeah, look at how beautiful. Nothing in real life is as beautiful as nature. That is not gorgeous. It is gorgeous. Imagine it. I spray painted. Gabby, Sophie cleaned it. You're cleaning it. Imagine I cleaned it and then Gabby painted it. Don't, or Sophie painted it. Don't spray paint it. Get a, I'll get you some acrylic paints and a really fine brush. You can color each one of these a different color. Can I see it? It's a hundred degrees. It's a hundred degrees outside. That is why we bring the boys in. Inside is only 78 degrees. First time in a stall. That was her first time in a stall. Okay, so we've done this for three days in a row. Let's see if we can get it go good. Okay, you can go to your stall. Please go quietly and calmly to your stall. Go ahead. Hurry up, because Gracie's gonna go and then it's gonna be a pandemonium. Come on. Come on. Oh gosh. Today she's like, no, I'm not going in. I'm not giving up my beautiful arena for the boys. You go in there. Not that one. Willow, this is where it goes wrong every day. This way. There you go. Right in there. Good girl. Um, mm -mm -mm, wrong room. Come on, in here. Yes, I know you like to smell everything. Isn't she so pretty though? Like, just looking at her makes me happy. In here. See, you can talk to horses and they... they respond appropriately come on in your room get in your room good girl come on hurry up before the boys come get in there go oh no come on don't make a liar out of me good girl get in I'll put some shavings and some food in there easy peasy this year every show that we go to has been canceled for the whole season like canceled except for the barn that we go to they are hopefully going to be having a couple of shows and we'll be doing them but we have some other ideas for horsey related stuff too we definitely want to take our horses swimming again and take kaylee with us this time so there's that on the agenda for summer as well as uh, some other fun things, horsey things, that we have up our sleeve. But for now, in the middle of a heat wave, we swim. That's all we do. That's all we do in the heat wave. Comment below what you guys do. If you want to be outside and you want to be doing stuff, what do you do in the middle of a heat wave? I'm aware that Australia has a heat wave every day, so you guys probably have the best advice. It's an umbrella. It's an umbrella, Stormy. Oh, you little sneaker. Come on. Hi, girls. Hi, Say hi to all the girls, Stormy boy. Chino, you getting fatter? Our last hula hoop and our last pool noodle. No, I've been kept the hula hoop. All right, Finny. Oh, God. Yeah, they act like they're scared of it when I'm here. But when we leave, they play with it. I'm sorry, Finny, that was for you. That was not good Molly. thinking. Molly, Ruby. Molly, Ruby. Basically what I did here, if they get really hot and Chino gets really bored and his head's over here, he's gonna just squirt water. Oh, that's such a or good idea. Or should I like open the lid a little bit? There he is right there. And then when he grabs it, it squirts water. <laughs> he gets him not to do it. Just squirt water at Chino. Look, he's got a piece of hay grass in his mouth. How do you get grass? There's a line up at the water cooler. Be careful. <laughs> Mom, the lid is off. Be careful. All right, Chino, we'll know. <laughs> We'll know if you were doing bad things. This is what he does. Nothing is safe. Oh, goodness. Listen. Feels like I'm making my way to the water now. Yeah, Finn's like, I need water. He tries to beat up Tina. Yeah, oh, stop. Finn! Oh, See, when you so scream at them, it does stop them. No, like, it does It does. I've seen him do. Do you stop it, you bad boy. <laughs> Look at how cute he is. That's the biggest bug I've seen him do. No, he listened to me. No. Finn! See, He's he listens. Listening. Finn! No, Finn! He isn't listening. Finn! <laughs> Finn. Listen. Small mom across the face. She's annoying. Finn! You're gonna get me that. He's listening. trying to kick Chino. They're extra hot today, maybe. It's he 100 degrees as hot. No, he thinks that he's the boss of Chino, but he's not. Is that a scab? I hate that he hurt his temple. I don't know what that is. That makes me nervous. You have to pick that off, Gabby. 
This one's scab. What is it then? No, it's a, it's a, it's a scab. Come here. So yeah, don't pick it off. It was a cut. That would hurt. All right, well let's wait till it yeah, gets a little. No, right. I brought two umbrellas home from the trailer. So every time I come down here, I'm trying to make it like more appealing, more fun. Such a small little space, it's hard. I dare you to stand on the ladder and then just fall back onto a tube. Under a tube? Yeah, Gabby will do it. We have Mrs. Brave and Mrs. Not So Brave. I'm gonna get crazy. Yeah. I don't like falling back from places. I don't either. Okay, move out of the way. Oh, well that was... <laughs> How cold is it? Freezing. It's 100 degrees outside. A snake, it is 80 degrees. It 80. Like uh oh. But the wind is even colder. We had a cottage growing up, and then when I had my boys, I had a cottage. I don't know if that's why I always feel like this is the one true time in life where I feel like I can relax reading my book and just hanging out while the kids swim and then floating around the pool myself. Um, my mom always did this. She was such a big, huge worker. She was always busy, always doing stuff. But when it came to summer and we were at our cottage, she always swam and read her book. And so I think that must be where I got it. What the heck? Look at the water. Look at the water. It's like this beautiful blue color peeking. What? The water. The water came up and splashed me. Sam's home and we swam for a long time today. Oh, super hot, 80 degrees. Um, but now we're headed to, remember I told you in yesterday's video that it was the start of our shopping spree. And so today continues the shopping saga. Today we are headed to the mall. The girls need some shorts. Gabby has, uh, you guys notice Gabby has not been wearing shorts. She has a couple of pair of gen denim shorts. That she, she has lots of shorts, but she won't wear any of them. But then she does have a couple of pairs that she loved last year, but she doesn't love this year, I guess. I don't know, but anyway, that's what we're gonna do. We're checking out the mall. They are comfy. You should get some comfy shorts then. No, we need more roots. No, there are no more roots. I'm not buying winter track pants for summer. There are gonna be days that you're gonna need shorts, like at the show. Can't sit anywhere. Get stickers to decorate your mask. Sophie, you want some stickers? You look handsome. Power of getting clothes. Does look like a doctor? You want stickers? Okay. There you go. Ripped jeans, ripped shorts. You want a tank shirt? Crop top tank shirt? My glasses are fogging up. Sophie's <laughs> got stickers. I'm busy and give me the money. <laughs> okay, Wendy. No way. Two, not your age. Mm mm. Nope, not happening. This is cute. Oh. I guess they're going in my pocket. Okay, Gabby, get shopping. My kids have a hard time shopping. So she found some blue jeans, or some blue shorts, some black shorts, and this shirt, which is so super soft, but I'm against it. It look, looks kind of hoochy. I wasn't anticipating the whole mask thing. I'm not gonna have to hand sanitize my hands. We did it two times already. That's cute. All right, that's good. Do you like this bathing suit top? It's really cute. It's orange. Mom, do you like it? <laughs> all right. So now we're now we're in garage. Gabby's getting all her stuff. Then we're going to Sophie's store. That's so cute. We got, we got this designer change room. It's cheetah print. It's got a chair. It's just got a, yeah, got a nice mirror. All right, Gabby, try the shirt. Yeah. All right, so we are in the bathing suit. What? Hand sanitizer. Yeah, we have so much hand sanitizer. All right, so I like that bathing suit, Sophie. I think that would be beautiful on you. No, the blue one. Yeah, do you like that? Kind of. It's so cute. All right, do you see a bathing suit you like? I kind of like this. Yo, oh, the pineapples. I love pineapples. It's super cute. I don't really want it. You don't really want right, it? Let's go. Beautiful change room. Number two. It's small. It's small. Don't change. Don't video. Don't video. Don't change. These are the things up for grabs. 
Gabby found a shirt, so if you find a shirt. All right, so this is Gabby's very first time in the store, in the drugstore, since she started wearing makeup. So this is like the first time she could actually buy her own makeup, oh, like right. pick up her own makeup. Yeah, I buy you all the stuff that's for um, sensitive so skin. My hands went from completely yeah. wet to dry. Yeah. So it was like not that bad. Was it that bad? Like it took us a couple of hours. Oh yeah. gosh, <laughs> like almost two hours. Yeah, it took us over two hours. But we got no, supper. Oh, we got supper. We you have to get it in takeout. And the odd thing about my girls compared to my boys is like when I would go shopping with the boys, they would want everything. Like there was never a time when they like they would look and find all the things. Well, actually, I guess only one of my boys was like that. But my kids literally are content to just go naked, and not have any clothes. They can wear the same clothes every day, not even care. They don't care. Like. Gabby got a pair of shorts and a couple of shirts, maybe three shirts. Sophie got a shirt, maybe two, two shirts, two shirts, yeah. And then they got a bunch of like stuff at the drugstore. But we'll show you when we get home. Oh, Sophie's gonna tell you what she got. Okay, so first thing I got is lipstick. She got lip gloss. Super cute from the drugstore. It's the first time the girls ever bought anything from the drugstore, I think. I got scrunchies. Because one day she's gonna actually put her hair in a bun or in a ponytail, all on her own. Don't get ice cream on it. <coughs> um, then I got this little shirt, which I'm gonna wear over top of my bathing suit. Got this little shirt, it says Barbie, and it's pink and white. Super cute. Then I got this black shirt. Just a plain Jane black t-shirt. Everybody needs one black t-shirt. You guys might not have noticed, but these are the earrings that Sophie's been wearing since she was nine weeks old when she got her ears pierced. No, not nine weeks old, since she was about a year old. So she's been wearing this for almost 10 years, these earrings. And as cute as they are, they don't really fit her anymore. So we ended up at the drugstore, we found these sleeper earrings, and they are BioCare Comfort ones, so they don't cause any kind of allergic reaction. And then she also got these pink little stud ones. Oh, these are the scrunchies that Sophie got. They're really cute. I like the color. I love just neutral colors. Those are the only things that Sophie got because those are the only things that Sophie wanted to get. Gabby, what did you get? I have to model them, so let me eat. Okay. Oh. The other thing that Sophie got that you guys don't know is that... Oh, by the way, my mom paid for all of this. Yeah. So, Sophie has... Sophie has really curly hair. Like, you guys might not be able to tell, but her hair is so curly. Like, so, so, so curly. And it's just annoying because every time she brushes it, it turns More to I frizz. Braid my hair, you're using these. All right, so. Well, I bought it because the white one. I told her that there's a way to take care of your curly hair that you don't have to brush it all the time, that you don't have to yeah, do anything with it. You just kind of scrunch it. Can I do the first open? Yeah, so I bought her this special stuff for her hair. Smells like hairspray. Yeah. So, uses so tomorrow, the world. tomorrow she's gonna try and be it will kill a whole the new curly get haired girl. Okay, so outfit number one that Gabby got. She bought these shorts that actually are not too bad. They're pretty acceptable. Um the they only have thing this underneath the thing. So very similar to her jeans. Except that they don't have bare skin underneath it. Just no bare no skin bare underneath. underneath those are the shorts. I like the shorts. I don't mind the shorts. The shirt I absolutely said no to and then she tried it on and it felt really soft and then I said yes but now at home it looks way more more old than it did at the store. So yeah I don't know. Somehow she sucked me into it but here's the one thing that I believe in. I honestly and truly believe that confidence comes within and when I was 13 I was so embarrassed about my body I kept it always covered completely and looking back when I was 13 and 15 and 20 those were all the best times of my life with my body and I wish looking back I always wish that I loved it more and that I respected it more and that I appreciated it more and so she has a healthy concept of her body and I'm not going to take that away from her and that shirt will not leave the house. She'll only wear it at home. And and Sophie put her hair in her very first bun. I love it, Sophie. Well, where's your hair yeah, it's adorable. You do not look 80 at all. <laughs> Just kidding. Did you put the lipstick on? 
No. Cute. Do you like it? Super cute. I love it. Good job. Shirt number two. She only got one pair of shorts, but short shirt number two, similar to the first, except for it has sleeves. She saw all these shirts on TikTok. TikTok no. is changing. No, TikTok is changing the fashion world. I haven't seen world. these uh, Gabby also got earrings like Sophie, but they are oh, diamonds. Okay. And she also got a black gold peel off mask. Charcoal. Face mask, charcoal face mask that she wanted. Charcoal plus 24 karat gold. Uh, Sophie got really nice lip gloss. I put it on. Like, having girls makes you kind of get back into it. Like, I think I'm going to get some of that lip gloss for myself. It, that's one of my favorite colors, that pink color that Sophie got. I also got one of her earrings in, but this one is kind of closed over, so I wasn't able to get it in. But yeah, we're all turning into women at the same time. All right, that is it for today. I hope you guys had a great day. We'll see you guys tomorrow.